How's it going, everybody? It's Fake Bennett here, and now it's time for Pokemon Showdown Scoreboard Episode One, Season Two. Numbers and words and stuff. I don't, I don't, I don't know anymore. So, yeah. Uh, in the last episode, we determined who our first six would be. Um, we found who our first six would be, and uh, yeah, uh, I, I think I did. I did pretty much what I could with these guys. So we're just going to start off with uh, my mask, which is. Yeah, mask. But he's mine. So it's my mask. See, see how it works. We did wind up being an RU, which is decent considering I have like three little cups. <laughs> but yeah, we're wait a second. Verizion's an R why? Why is Verizion an RU? Alright, whatever. Okay, how do we do this? Screw it. Toxic Spikes. Might as well get the setup. Um, Yeah, Mask actually isn't too bad as far as stats go. Uh, he's pretty, really, really, really defensive. Uh, that is not good. It's not good at all. I don't see a Heal Beller, though. So I'm just going to... But I do see a Poison type. Can't remember the last time I saw a Skun Tank. Mmm, that hurt. Does anyone have Sap Sipper, perhaps? I don't remember. No, do I have a special defender? What's your special? 166? How do you have more special? Whatever. It'll be neutral because electric resists grass. Right? Um. I feel like it should. Uh, it doesn't. It doesn't resist grass. All right, we've learned something today. <laughs> I don't know. I think this Verizon is just gonna wreck my whole <laughs> goddamn team. Steel should resist it, but I don't know if it's gonna matter because it's one one stage calm minded. Shameless promotion right there for Monster. So the uploads for these are gonna be. I'm going to try to do once a week on Saturdays. Just because it's easier for me to do it that way. I was resisted and I still didn't have my health. This is dumb. Um, 126. 346. I'm just going to bring out Flatten. He's going to die just so I can get the free switch. <laughs> I need the free switch on it. On it. Swag. I don't know if he's faster, but he is choice scarfed. So, wow, actually lived. It's probably hidden power. Hidden fire. Hidden power fire. I should have saved uh, flattened here. He has the stealth rocks. Should have easily saved him. Put them hazards up. Okay, so he is fodder for now. Does he also has leftovers? What the fuck? I mean, 295, half of 295 should be faster. Um, for all it's worth, I really should be. So, let's see. Never used this point before. In fact, I've never used a lot of these Pokemon before, but whatever. McFightin'. Uh, he's justified, so I should not use knockoff. I'm just gonna go earthquake. He has no levitators, so I have nothing to lose. And one, two, three. Wow, he has a lot of weaknesses to this, actually. Ooh, ooh, the switch. Ooh, ooh. Um, does anyone else have earthquake? I'm just gonna stay with uh, the McFight and just keep going for the earthquakes. Because these things are usually EV light defensive and then they just swords dance to a. Uh, oh, the Shadow Claw. Earthquake again, I got nothing to lose. Like, oh, I forgot I had Sturdy, so I really had nothing to lose. No, but since he's. Since nothing on his team is his levitate, unless, like, Rhyperior is wearing. or has an air balloon or something. Because if I can get rid of Ska Tank, then I can come back with Yamask Mask and do the spikes again, and then I should be able to poison everyone on this team. 
that a Marlo or whatever it's called should have heal bell though. They usually carry it. So yeah. Oh, stop. So let's see. He's taking a sweet time trying to figure out what to do here. Lighthouse. I wonder why he needed a lighthouse. So perhaps because it looks like a lighthouse? I don't know. Whatever. Whatever. It switches out. Oh, there it is. Okay, now is when I switch. Because this thing is going to kill me, but I have a feeling it's either going to heal bell or toxic, so I'm going to switch out to Magnemite. Um, Magnemite should be able to live almost anything this thing can dish out, unless it has, like, hidden power fire. It has wish. Okay. So, we Volt Switch. We Volt Switch because he's probably going to wish on the Parisian. It wouldn't surprise me. No, he can't go for the Heal Bell unless he wants to use it on the Armaldo. Why do I keep calling it an Armaldo? Uh, fucking, what does this thing even call it? Aromatease or something? Ah, there it is. He switched out to Ben. And with Ben, we're going to switch out to you. Never used a Scud Tank, and I'm actually kind of, kind of want to know what it's all about. I should have gone for the knockoff because no, 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 no. This is this is the best move to go for right now. Oh God. Oh God. All right. Um, I know what to do. So my. Uh, apparently this guy is Spanish because I don't understand what he's saying in the chat. He did say ha ha ha, so there's that. Um, all right, wish. Got my Mr. Penguin out. So it's a torrent with a life orb. So basically the idea is to substitute to get my life as low as it can be, but then do surf all day because it'll just kill everything. Because he's probably not expecting the Ice Beam on this thing. Hell, I'm not expecting the Ice Beam on this thing. He's going to go for Giga Drain. Or Calm Mind. He's going to go for Calm Mind, actually. I'm going to go for the Ice Beam Plate Save. Because the, the, the whole point is the Life Orb and the Substitutes bring your life down. Um, I should have gone... You know what? I should have given it Roost instead of Defog. Because Hazards aren't really too apparent, are you? It would have been a much better thing to do. There's the Giga. There's the crit. The crit. <laughs> um, could I live another Giga Drain? I don't think so. I mean, my special D isn't horrible. Well, we'll see. I sincerely doubt it. Is he going to switch? I wish there was a move that, like, increased your... Oh! 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 Oh, look at that! Oh, it wasn't crit. Oh, yeah, right. Oh, well. I wish there was a move that increased your speed if you got below a certain health. I think there is. I just can't... Whatever. So, the question is, is he going to sack this thing, or is he going to stay in? I'm sorry, that's the same thing. Is he going to sack this thing, or is he going to switch? I'm going for knockoff. I feel like I have nothing to lose going for it. Because Justify doesn't make you immune. It just makes it so if you get hit by one, you, uh... Does Justify make you immune? I don't think it does. Yeah, sweet. Alright. Boom. Okay. And now we got a little Mac. Or Mac. Because I didn't, I wanted, I didn't want to be generic. This isn't going as bad as I thought it would, actually, with all these little cups. There's the flame orb, and now we pursuit. Because he's going to switch. Wow. 
wasn't really sure what to put on Tyro because his move set isn't the same as the other hit moans. Which is pretty unique in a sense because he doesn't have the same move set as his evolutions can get, which is pretty cool, I gotta say. Um, he can't learn. Can he learn Rapid Spin? I don't remember. I do not remember. But he has the Guts ability, which is why I gave him the Flame Orb. Uh, there goes a switch that did nothing. <laughs> Like, absolutely nothing. Alright, um, I can't touch this thing with Tyrogue. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So we are gonna go out to my mask and see what we can do. See what we can do. See what we can do. Come on. What can we do? If he would ever, if if he would ever cho choose choose something to do, um, I hate people who do this and just sit there and wait. I mean, go ahead and take your time and make the move. But Jesus, if you know what you're gonna do, do it. Swords dance. I should be able to live a hit from no, no, no. It's swords dance. There's no way I'm gonna live a hit from this thing. Ugh, damn. If I did the pain split. No, wait. Not. Nah, nah, I can't stop. No. It's not what I wanted to do. No. What is he? He has an Evil Light. I gotta knock that. I have to get rid of the Evil Light. I mean, uh, unless McFighting can live, which I don't think he can. Yeah, there goes the Shadow Sneak. That's game. I can't do anything about this. Damn you, Pokemon, making such a strong ass fucking thing. This thing needs to, this thing needs to be an OU. Like now. All I can do is Bullet Punch. <laughs> that's, that's all I got. Everything else that's immune to in pursuit would do like nothing. <laughs> it's great. It's great, guys. It's okay. Um, Might Man. You can hear my dog in the background. Might Man, let's do this. Already made registration. Don't say I have 150 seconds. I have no options. Might Man. Thunder wave it, Might Man. <laughs> Even though it doesn't matter, he's just gonna kill, uh, kill us, like, legitimately. Even though I didn't kill a single one on his team, I, I, I feel like if he didn't have the Elmaldo, I would have. So. Uh, GG, my good friend. GG. Okay, here we are with battle number two. Another Doublade. This is foreshadowing, I'm sure. Um, he's Steel. And he's probably going to start with the Ambipom. So we're just going to go with the Yum. Actually, no. I have a plan. I have a very devious plan. Also, I like how he made all those shinies, except for Electros. So they're all purple. <laughs> it's pretty cool, actually. Gonna yawn this thing. Stealth works aren't really too concerning. He has no flying types or fire types, so. But he does have one, two, two weaknesses. Ooh, the taunt. Oh, I hate you so much. Screw it, I'm just gonna go for the earthquake. Come on, Flattened, you got this. That hurt. Is is a stun fisk about to kill a Drapion? I think a stun fisk is about to kill a Drapion. That's just blowing my mind right now. 
Some of the things you're seeing here, I actually have a Marowak on my main team now. Be oh my god. Uh, okay. It's okay. Mistakes were made. Ah, fuck it. Is there anything on his team immune? Yes. The double eight is immune to fighting. And that's why it's so stupidly annoying because it's immune to toxic and fighting. Um, I want to go for the knockoff. No, I don't. Yes, Stone Edge. I'm going to go for the Stone Edge. It's neutral for everything on his team. Because if he stays in with this thing and I go for knockoff, it. Oh, no, oh, see, seem good. Okay. No, it's not neutral to everything on his team. Son of a bitch. Alright, um. I can't even toxic it. That's the shittiest thing about it. I can't fake it out. I can't do anything to it. God damn it. Ghost Steel is such a good typing. Stop being such a good typing. I wonder if he knows if I'm choiced. I forgot to like resist. Fuck, why is Ghost Steel such a good typing? What do we do? Fire and ground? The only thing you can do to it is burn it. See this shit of special <laughs> shitty special defense. Maybe, probably not. Of course, he's just going to shadow sneak me to death. That's the other reason I hate, I hate Double Eight is because it has priority moves. But it can do Swords Dance. This thing needs to be... It. Oh, oh, I lived it. What? The opposing does a... Oh my god. I lived a hit from a Double Eight. That is ridiculous. Oh, whoops. Does Pain Split work on ghost types? I mean, I'm going to die regardless, so I'm not even going to go for it, but still die. Would it? This is my most defensive. Oh, fuck. I hate double eight. It's ruining my entire teams. All of them. No one is going to live. All six of these people are going to change today because I can't kill double eight. I should have just let it die and went for the free switch on a swag. Or. Hope I can kill it with a thunderbolt. I feel like normal. I'm retarded. I almost said I feel like normal should be immune to ghosts. And I remembered it is. I just don't have a normal that because Wax fighting. I thought he was normal. So, like I was saying before, uh, I'm going to start uploading these. Try to do at least one of it, one a week. Um, I know that seems, you know, like it should be more. But, ah, oh, the crit! <laughs> I feel like that should be more, but um, it's really hard with, with the way my work schedule has been lately. And I'm going to West Point for like three weeks here in a couple months. So, yeah. There will be more League content on the page. Um... Because I finally fixed my recording software, and that was the reason why uh, I haven't really put anything up in the last couple weeks, at least until the shit scoreboard yesterday. Because the, the my recording stuff, my computer was being stupid. But I finally fixed it, so uh, now that that's the case, um, he's going to go for fake out. I'm not stupid. He's not going to go for fake out and make me look stupid, probably. I, I don't I don't even know. But Amy Palm doesn't really ruin anything other than fake out. I remember back when I first started getting back into competitive, every Ambipom had the same moveset. It was Fake Out and Last Resort. That's all it had. That's it. But now, I don't know. Okay. How did you not come? I don't. That's the thing I don't understand. He had the switch in, so he, he should have had a plan coming into this. But apparently he didn't. Come on, Amy. Amy Palm. Join.
it's, it's my man, just kill him. Just do the fake out, kill him. It'll be fine. Okay. He's contemplating his move pretty, pretty, pretty thoroughly. Um, not sure what he's trying to do. Um, what you doing, bro? What you doing? What you doing, bro? You got 90 seconds, probably less, because I just looked at that right now, and I know it came up earlier. What you doing? Huh? Huh? Oh, my dog's not here no more. I thought he was. Scared me. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. So, the idea for this channel right now is to keep the content related to League of Legends and Pokemon. Because they're the two games I play probably the most. Aw, oh, man. I feel like I just... I don't know. I'm recording them. It's fun sometimes. Other times it's very tasking and I don't like doing what I'm doing. But, but most of the time it's pretty fun. I mean, I hit 500 subscribers, uh, the other day, which is awesome. Uh, I don't have that many views, so I'm, well, I'll figure out why that is eventually, but whatever. Uh, yeah. Why is this guy waiting this whole time? Just make a move or forfeit. I don't, like, I don't even know why he's going to think about forfeiting. He's got an extremely good chance of winning here. Obviously, he thinks he's going to make me forfeit with his mind games. Come on, man. Oh. He lost. Um Okay, we're back uh, with the with the third and final battle of today. <gasps> so I dub late. I'm happy. I'm happy with this. There's gonna be something else on his team that's gonna make me mad, but I don't care, I'm happy with this. He has no steel types. Yeah, mask is coming up first. I'm setting up the spikes. There's nothing to get rid of them except for Claydol. Who's probably going to be who he sets up with. But he but he has no steel types or no poison types, so I can poison everything on his team. Which is fine by me. So we come up with the toxic spikes. I'm only going to put one layer up. There's no reason to put two layers up right now because the clay doll is out. Or still, still a thing. It probably, it might not even have rapid spin, but I'm assuming it does. Um, you always have to assume your enemy has an upper hand on you. The protect ain't gonna work for the toxic effects. I don't know what he was thinking I was gonna do, and now I poison him. I don't even see any healers unless Lantern can learn Heal Bell. I don't think it can. Pretty interesting to see. Um, Oh, I'm so sorry. He missed the leech seed. He forfeited! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, that's, that's, that's incredible. Oh my god. Oh my god. So, after much math and calculations and such, uh, Stunfisk will be leaving us with a score of minus one. Uh, for curiosity's sake, uh, Magnemite plus three, Stunfisk minus one, Prenhead plus one, Swaghead plus one, Tyrellic at plus one, and your Mask at plus two. So, do the math there, and only one of them had negatives, and it was Stunfisk. I'm not going to complain about. So let's see who will be replacing Stunfisk in the next Pokemon showdown. Guaranteed. <laughs> Why? Like, comment, and subscribe. It helps. It really, really helps. Big Bennett out.